nails are starting to chip and they've been on for almost a week. I always, almost always do them myself, so I am going to fix this situation. <laughs> okay, all better. All cut and filed, and I'm going to repaint either today or tomorrow. I'll keep you updated. So I just got out of spin class. It was great. I have never been to this studio before, um, but I really enjoyed the class. It was great. Um, so now I am just going to head home and get something to eat, refuel, and shower because I am so sweaty. Does anyone else get so red when they work out and sweat? Because I swear I look like a tomato after my workout and everyone else looks just like glistening and good and I'm just like dying. So I actually decided to just wash my face for now. I need to re-put up my hair because, I don't know, it's kind of crazy. Um, but I'm not really sure what else I'm going to do for the day so I will keep you guys updated on what I decide to do. Hi, so I just wanted to pop in really quick. I realized I didn't even start this vlog to begin with. I just kind of started it, no intro. And I also kind of wanted to discuss like why I'm doing a vlog. Um, I've never ever done a vlog on my channel ever before. Um, but that's what I've been really interested in watching myself personally recently. So I just decided, you know, if I like watching them so much, um, Maybe it's something that I would have fun with, you know, filming and editing. So I'm just kind of trying something new and getting out of my comfort zone a bit. And they're just on my phone because my camera's too big. Um, so we're just going to try this out. So I just showered, got all clean from that sweaty spin class that I took earlier today and just got on some comfy clothes and I'm just kind of hanging for the day. Um, I'm just listening to Gals and Go podcast, which is actually done by two YouTubers that I absolutely love. They're probably two of my favorites, uh, Danielle Carolyn and Brooke Michio. In this episode, they're kind of talking about how to have a productive summer, which is something that I'm looking to do. So a very relevant to me right now and would recommend. So I just got to my spinning class that I'm about to go into, but something I didn't do yesterday is bring two water bottles, and I definitely regretted it because my drive is about 20 or 25 minutes back home. Um, so I bring this Camelback water bottle inside just because it's easy to sip. I have brought my hydro flask in before, and it's just really annoying because it's not easy access with the lid that I have, but I know some people have the straw lid, which is great. And I just ate one of these little, like, blueberry Belvita little breakfast things and then I'm gonna eat the rest after class um, but with my hydro flask it will stay cool for after class which is great hopefully the ice will still be in it but it always is so love that <laughs> So I just finished spinning class again and I'm about to head home, but I'm so happy that I have my hydro flask of nice cold water because you definitely finish a full water bottle in a spin class and it's a great sweat and a great workout. Honestly, I, I used to hate working out in high school until I found spinning. And it is not only a great workout, but honestly, I really enjoy doing it. And I think it definitely depends on the place that you go to and the instructor that you have. But it, you honestly, when it comes to working out, you just have to find something that works for you. And, and that might take a little longer and kind of testing out different classes or different routines. But if you haven't tried spinning, I would highly recommend it. So I am showered. <clears throat> I got dressed and had some lunch. My top is from Zara and my jeans are from Old Navy. Then I'm just wearing my three strap Birkenstocks, which I love. And I think I'm gonna do my makeup and then I'm going to film a video. So stay tuned. So my makeup is all ready to go. It's pretty simple. Um, I'm thinking of doing a get ready with me like a chit chat type video at some point uh, so you guys can see all like my updated products and what I do with my makeup. But now I'm getting ready to film some videos.
videos. I think I'm actually going to film a couple, so stay tuned. I'm really going to try and upload frequently this summer, so stay tuned. You're almost done with the video and your camera dies and your backup battery is dead. We love that. <laughs> I don't know what happened because said that it had like a hundred some minutes left of battery so I don't really know what the deal is but I'm charging up and I can finish my outro or whatever later um, but I actually think I'm gonna import some vlog put vlog, bleh, <laughs> vlog footage right now and kind of get started on editing that um, just because I really want to get another video up today or maybe tomorrow so I started to edit this vlog and I edited everything I have so far and it's already at almost six minutes, so I'm making pretty good progress. I mean, I'm not trying to make it like super, super long, but I'm thinking I'll go until today is Friday. I've only been filming two days, um, and I guess I was just planning to go till next Thursday and make it like a week in my life type video, but we shall see. So I literally just filmed three videos. <laughs> I don't know what got into me, but I just felt like I was on a roll, and I decided to just kind of like start, and well, I guess I'm not finished with the series yet, um, because I still have to do my senior year, but I did freshman through junior year kind of my experience videos, so go ahead and check those out if they're out yet. <laughs> so, some people may have spilled the beans already, but... We are going to Nashville for one night. Oh my god. We're going to Nashville on Friday. Okay. And then after that, on Saturday morning, we are going to drive about an hour away to this place that Miss H found. It's right by Seven Hill Lake in Tennessee. It's called Sparta, but we're staying in this cabin. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's so cool. This looks so it's cool. Not 